So the year is 2022 and you wanna make more money by starting your own business. Well, the great news is in today's video, I'm gonna run through some fantastic business ideas that are worth considering if you're looking to start a business in 2022. So Money Mondays, where we talk all about how you can get your money right. Today, it's all about making more money by starting your own business. A lot of people do this, they set this as their New Year's resolution. They wanna get out of an employment they might not be happy with, or they just want a side income where they can make more money that they're gonna to use to invest and build up that asset base so that they're financially free and secure in retirement. No matter what the reason is, today's video is gonna help you as we've got some great business ideas that you've probably not even thought about. So we're gonna get stuck straight in. Number one is consulting. So if you've got any experience in the past in any kind of technical specialist field whatsoever, I guarantee you, you could probably make money consulting in that sector. So if you've been a lawyer, an accountant, a builder, a hairdresser, anything like this, you've got some kind of skill which you can then go in and consult people. So you know, touch on the hairdresser, if you've previously had a hairdressing business, if you've got experience in that, you can make money by talking about that to other people and helping them do it better. So that's a fantastic one. And indeed, of course, the more specialist your sector is, the more you can probably charge when it comes to offering your services out. So accountants and solicitors, when they consult, they can charge significant sums. But obviously, the more you learn, so if you are in the consulting sector, digital media consulting, for instance, you can do a lot more learning. So just because you may not know too much about it now, if you invest in your skill set, learn more, you're gonna increase the value of you as a person, and as a result, you can charge more, earn more, and make more money. So second, we've got online selling. This is a fantastic one. eBay, Amazon, Etsy. If you've got products that you can make yourself and sell, this is a fantastic side hustle for creative people. Or if you've just got things that you can buy and sell. So if you enjoy going to car boots, getting things for 50p, you can put them on eBay quite often and make a decent return on that. 10, 15 pound an item might not sound like much, but if you're selling 50, 100 items a week, that can very easily be a good income stream. And of course, the people that have good academics, so if you've been to university, got good degrees, A-levels, you can do online tutoring. So whether it is children in school, A-levels, university, if you've got some kind of specialist skill in an area, you can do online tutoring, 20, 30 pounds an hour, which is a great job, or it's a fantastic side business, depending on how far you wanna go ahead with it. And another one, bookkeeping, that's a fantastic one. So bookkeepers can get paid quite a lot of money, especially here in the UK. Uh, I know people that have built bookkeeping practices and they turn over in excess of hundreds of thousands of pounds with very good profit margins. So if you know about bookkeeping, you've previously it in the past, fantastic. If not, you can certainly get started. There are courses you can do on bookkeeping, the ICB, for instance, the Institute of Certified Bookkeepers, and that is, they do courses, so within one year, you should be competent enough, you'll know enough to basically start charging people to do work for them, and then from each there onwards, you'll develop your skill set, and as you get more experience, you can charge more, bring on members of staff, and grow a business that way. That's a fantastic way. Transcription services, so people watching videos like this, people like having them as blogs, and watching videos like this, typing them up into a blog, Fiverr, Upwork, you can earn a good amount of money doing this on the side as a business. So cleaning, it's what many people call a boring business, and this is because it's not sexy, it's not online, doesn't involve massive amounts of money, you know, you're not gonna scale this to billions of dollars at the end of the day, but it's a steady industry. It's been around for the past 100 years, it's gonna be around for the next 100 years. Whether it's domestic or commercial cleaning you're going after, there's still a massive need for it. With this industry, there are a lot of people that do it and do not do it well. You've got small one-man band companies, they're not professional, they're not reliable. So for somebody that's able to come in, look at the pain points and offer a better professional service, they can certainly make a lot of money. After this, you've got virtual assistants, VAs. That's another massive opportunity. Certainly in the UK, what this involves is diary management, social media posts potentially, replying to emails, answering telephone calls, that kind of stuff. And for somebody who can do this well, very competently and work quite fast, there's no reason you can, uh, can't earn 20, 25 pounds an hour, which is 50,000 pounds a year with a laptop. That's all you need to start making serious money as a VA. 
And then kind of flown off the back of this, we've got copywriting as well. So a lot of people pay valuable money for this, like writing good copy for websites, products pages. If you can do this, it's a skill that you will need to learn or have. There are courses, YouTube, Udemy. If you spend three months putting some work in to learn this skill, you can definitely, off the back end of that, start a business and start charging people serious money to do copywriting from anywhere in the world with just a laptop. All you've got to do is put that work in to start with and you can easily do that by the resources that are available online and then sell your services either to customers, Fiverr, Upwork. There's plenty of different options there. And then digital marketing as well. This is a massive one, especially for the kids these days. Essentially, if you are new, you're kind of fresh out of uni, fresh out of school, because a lot of the business world is still a lot older, you might have loads of companies local to you that don't even have a Facebook page, they're not even on Google potentially. There's a massive opportunity there for loads of quick wins. And then for people that have experience in digital marketing, they can do real paid for campaigns for people. Of course, that's a fantastic business, working with smaller businesses, helping them build their online presence and make more money. Digital marketing is a good opportunity because you're going to business and saying, hey, let me help you make more money and you can easily show them the value that you're going to add. Another one, not really a business, but it's certainly additional income stream, is viewing houses. If you'd like getting out and about and you like property, there are actually property investors that will pay you to view houses for them. There's a whole host of different websites available online and you have to go around, take pictures, videos, do a checklist where the actual property purchaser isn't available to view the property themselves. This is a fantastic way to earn extra money. And then we've got another boring business, Laundry, whether this is doing it for businesses or people's laundry from a domestic point of view. Think about the people in your area. You know, you could be doing their washing, doing their ironing. This is a great way because the barrier to entry is so low. Chances are you've got a washing machine and a tumble dryer and an iron. That's all you need to get started. And by the time you've done this, think about people in your area. You can literally print off, hand write even potentially, depending on exactly where you are, what your position is. Hand write some things out, go door knocking, say hi. We're looking at starting a laundry business. Would you be interested? This would free up your time and we can do it for a fantastic price. The chances are you would come back to your house that day with a full book of customers. And then the last one, we've got affiliate marketing. This has been around for many years, but it's still a popular one, especially with social media these days. It's very easy to build a following of people who share your interests. And as a result, products and services that you can use, you can recommend to them and actually make money in the back. So with Amazon, Amazon affiliates is a fantastic one. You can literally just look at the products you use and make 10% on some products on Amazon. Of course, there is a whole host around it. I'm sure if you do a quick Google or a YouTube search, you'll get loads. But this is just to give you an idea that affiliate marketing is still alive in 2022 and is a great way to make money. So there we have it. There's some fantastic business ideas that if you're looking to start a business in 2022 and you're not sure where to start, definitely have a look at these because we've gone through this list. I've kind of thought about the barriers to entry, the startup capital required. And for a lot of these, there really isn't much to it. You can watch this video today and by this time tomorrow you could have your first customer and be making your first sale so if you've got any questions at all drop them in the comments otherwise thank you very much for watching guys give this video a thumbs up if you found it useful giving it a thumbs down if you didn't you know it's all good either way but if you want to see more of me subscribe notifications turned on bye for now